Contrary to what is being posted online by the profane, the current evergreen fiasco does not benefit China, at least not on the surface. A blockage in the Suez increases the prices of Chinese goods in comparison to those produced locally in the EU. And from what I've read, it makes it harder for China to make a case for developing the iron ore deposit in Guinea, since the Suez Passage is the fastest ship route from there to China. Keep in mind that the Suez is part of China's maritime Silk Road and is in fact a gateway to Europe. All of this happens coincidentally while sanctions over China's treatment of Muslim minorities might lead to the EU-China trade getting cancelled. Bear in mind that right now, China is trying to replicate what led to America's domination in world trade. They're trying to build their own Panama Canal, either through Nicaragua or Colombia. So this isn't just about global trade. This is either the USA starting to play China's own game of underhanded warfare, or something more. What? You're asking? Pause and read the following screenshot I found on Twitter. Also worth noting that a similar but much milder scenario in Christmas 2005 resulted in delays on the global supply chain and in thousands of people losing their jobs. Last but not least, a LARPer posted about a similar scenario last month. Pause again to read. As always, research everything and Godspeed friends.